Hello? Alright, we are back ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Fallout 3. I am Aaron1249, G41 Nazgul, and we are going to start the DLCs. I mean, we've already completed Broken Steel, but we still have Mothership Zeta, Operation Anchorage, the, the Pit, and Point Lookout to do. And we're going to start off with uh, Mothership Zeta. So I'm just going to turn this on, turn the radio signal on. Head in this direction. That's over. You're welcome. Evening. Any enemies close by? No, but there is radiation. Keep going. Holy hell, we hit the mother load. Spacecraft. Let's go explore. It's probably another adventure to be had. Uh oh. I like the look of this. Uh. Yeah, I definitely don't like the look of this. Help. Uh, ghoul buddy. Uh, remember that time I saved you from the Now it's your turn to save me. Help. Help. Uh, I guess he won't be coming to my rescue. Thanks a lot, you jerk! Uh, blue lights. Oh god, I think I'm gonna be sick. Ooh. You okay? You all right? About time you woke up. I was starting to think maybe they'd fried your brains or something. You got a headache, right? Don't worry, that'll get better. I don't know if it'll matter, but it'll get better. They must really like you. At least they let me keep my clothes. Looks like they stripped you of everything. Uh, this has to be a bad dream. Yeah? Well then wake the hell up, because I'm tired of being stuck in it. Sorry, kid, but this is really happening. You're stuck here just like me. Okay, so who... Okay, so what do they want with us? Your guess is as good as mine. I can't understand what they're saying. I don't remember half of what they did to me. And that might be a good thing. I know we ain't the only ones. There's a whole bunch of us in here. They'll pluck folks out every now and then. Sometimes they bring them back, sometimes they don't. Either way, I ain't keen to find out what they're doing. Okay, so who are you and why are you in here with me? You've got it all wrong, kid. You're in here with me. This is my little slice of heaven, not yours. Not a good time for jokes, I guess. Look, I don't know why they put you in here with me. Maybe it's another experiment. Not like I can ask them to find out. But since you asked, name's Soma. Beyond that, I'm thinking not much matters if we're gonna stay stuck in here. Uh, fair enough. So how do we get out of here? Do we just bust the door open or something? I've been here for a little while, but haven't found a way to... Shit. You hear that? It's coming again. Get back against the wall now. What's coming? Sama? What exactly coming? 
Oh, you're just gonna stand there and... Uh oh. Hello? Well, at least it wasn't coming for us. What is it? I don't think it's up there. Ugh. Don't like that look. Don't like the look at that. Not at all. Don't lose it, okay? We can get through this. I'm not losing it. I just saw a guy get carried away by a giant claw. I'm thinking maybe now you can understand. It's a good idea to get the hell out of here. Okay, what the hell was that thing and what, where were they taking that guy? What? You've never seen a giant metal claw scoop somebody up and carry them off to who knows where? I don't know where they're taking him, and I'm not interested in staying here long enough to find out. We gotta get out of here, kid. Now! So, uh, how do we get out of here? Okay, yeah. Let's do something about getting out. Well, there ain't no easy way out. Trust me. I've looked. Can't even find anything to pry open. See what's blocking the doorway. I'm thinking they did us a favor, putting us together in here like this. And I say we use it to our advantage. <coughs> I'm not looking for a psychic, okay? I just want to get the hell out of here. Uh, you have a plan or are you making this up? What kind of advantage? They're keeping an eye on us, you know. Watching us. So I say we give them a little show. Give them a reason to pay a little extra attention to us. All right, sounds good. Uh, why don't you tell me what you have in mind? I'll take it over. No, that would be a good time for action. They want us alive for something. Who knows what? Point is, if it looks like one of us is gonna kill the other, they'll step in to stop it. So that's what we do. We throw a few punches, make it look real, and then jump them when they come in to break it up. That's the best you got? You really think this will work? Okay, so we got out of the cell, then what? Hell if I know. But at least it's a start. It's better than sitting here waiting for them to experiment on us even more. A mysterious stranger, this is stupid. There must be another way out. How do I not trust you? What if you try to kill me? So I'm gonna kill you, that will bring the guards. Okay, let's give it a try. Yeah, mysterious stranger perk right here. If we're lucky, a friend of mine might show up to help. Oh, uh, okay. So does that mean you're in? Okay, go ahead and hit me. Alright, I'll hold back on you. Make sure you don't get too roughed up, okay? And you be ready. Soon as they come in to get us, you take them down. All right, let's do it. Hit me! Come on, hit me! Hey, kid, be careful. Sorry. Ow, Shut hey, up. not too hard. Sorry, I gotta make it look real. Yeah, we're really fighting now, aren't we? Come on, Summer. Come on, Summer. Make it look real. Hit me! Come on! Hit me! Ooh, there they are. Come on, make it look real. I think they're buying it. Okay, now's our chance. Get up! I'm equipping the shock baton. Let's get the danger right here. Let's explore a little bit before we go. Because I want to get the collectibles. I'm 100%ing this DLC. Here, here, let's open this up. You're free, prisoner. Okay, I guess they don't want to be free. Nothing here. <clears throat> Nothing here. Dead bodies. Nothing here. 
Ooh, an enclave officer. Huh, <laughs> snazzy. Like a man uniform, Salma? Guess that's a no. The archway has destroyed some of your health. Salma? Where are you? Okay. Alright, that's... Noble loot of the opposite of the holding cell. Okay, that's one. Here it is. Three, twelve, one, and fourteen, fifteen, and twenty-two. Got them all. Still is still no visible way to open it. Nice chair. Can I be a captain or something? Ooh, sparkly. Can I press this? Beep boop pop beep boop. Did it work? Don't lose it, okay? We can get through this. Someone, we might want to stand back. I think that thing's gonna blow. Is it? Where'd you go? Did you see where Soma went, Sally? Thanks. Are you escaping? Do you want to see the rest of this place? I've seen a bunch. I can show you if you want. Okay, uh, you should you should wait here. It's too dangerous for a little girl. I think I got this under control. Okay, lead the way. Great! Yeah, for in that van, who knows what's in there? <clears throat> oh, great. Well, so much for that idea. She suckered you good, huh? I mean, come on. Are we really gonna just. We were really gonna just leave her there? Now, see, you were wrong. Thank you. See? I told you I could help. Thanks, kid. We're getting out of here. You want to come with us? How'd you do that? Listen, we're on danger if we stay here. Yeah, how'd you do that? Uh, actually, you know what? We're getting out of here. Want to come? Sure. I love exploring, and it's been a while since I've been out and about. We'll have to be careful, because they'll be mad that we're out. But it's okay. I know how to get through the steamworks. We need to get to the big engine room, so I can show you the rest of the ship. Let's go. How do you know so much about this place? Oh, I've been here a while. A long while. Sometimes, I can sneak out of my cell and go explore. I've seen a bunch of the ship. It's pretty neat. But they always catch me and put me back here. Uh, are y'all alone? Where's your family? I don't have any family anymore. Aww. My mom and dad died a while ago, before I ended up here. You know, 
Back when all the bombs dropped on everything. Yeah, it was right after that. And then me and my sister, we got pulled up here. Except, I haven't seen her in a long time. Well, I'm sure they're okay. Uh, do you know where we're going? Sure. We need to go to the big engine thing, and then from there, we can go up to the top of the ship. That's where the guy in charge is. I've only seen him once or twice, but he's extra mean. I guess you'll probably have to kill him or something, huh? Uh, okay. Let's keep moving. Okay. Come on! Hello. Oh. Well, good day to you too. Is this my loot? Yes, it is. I'll take power armor helmet. Hell yeah, I'm taking that. All right, I think I opened the door. Jeez, where I get all, all right? Cause, yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are. Summer, are you coming? Summer. Listen, I know how this shit works. We all go together, and we all get wiped out at the same time. No offense, but I'm gonna hang back for a bit. You need someone to keep an eye out behind you anyway. Don't worry, I'll catch up with you soon enough. All right, fair enough. But well, if we escape first, we'll probably come back for you. Sally? Sally, come on. It's you and me on an adventure. I wish Focus and Doggy were here. Are they gone yet? I guess they're already looking for us. I can sneak past them in the vents, but you're too big to fit. We'll have to figure out how to get around. How about I distract them and you hit them from behind with a grenade? Wow, really? I get to use a grenade? Neat! Take this plasma grenade. Got it. Give me a minute to sneak around them. All right. Hey, over here, you big dummies. No. Thanks for the loot. First, want to go into this room and see what's in here. Nothing. Is this a container? No. Nothing here. Nothing here. All right, let's continue onward. There's a strange little things again. Uh. Hurry up! I think they noticed I'm here. Uh oh. I think they know I'm here. Hurry up! <clears throat> oh my god, yes please. I got an alien atomata atomizer and a disintegrator. Let's see what this seems like. Oh. Ow! Ow, they're really hitting me. Okay, maybe I have my stuff back. Uh, shock baton! Heal! 
Oh, we're tough. At least I got all your loot. <laughs> eh, I might as well switch to the alien. Integrator. Fine. the ship a little bit. Oh. Following me. Oh. All right, enough games. Today the attack I could probably give to the Brotherhood. Oh wait, I'm stuck on the ship. What was that? Oh great, they're back again.
Well, that was a good hit. Damn! One hit kills. I should use this more often. I love you, Anna. Alien Adamizer. I love you too. Let's go kill aliens. Yeah! According to this, there's no loot to be found here. Terrific. Oh, did you kill this alien? No bump, good for this one. Might as well heal some. any of this. I don't know what it does, but it does something. I'll stay here until it's safe, okay? Alright, fair enough. Safe game. Oh yeah! All the crystal might be worth a fortune. Maybe Moria would want it. Maybe the Brotherhood would want it. I don't know. Oh yeah. What was that? Are they below me? Engineering core, do it. Okay, I'll show you what I found. If you want to get out of here, I think it'll help. Come on, follow me. Oh, nuts. 
They turned it off. Last time I was here, I used this to get to the top of the ship. It's kind of like an elevator, only it doesn't just go up and down. Feels sort of tingly, too. They must be pretty angry that we're exploring. Oh, I know. Come on, I know another way up. Ah, here I thought we were gonna get a big boss fight. <laughs> Immediately. Oh. So, this is it. Pretty neat, huh? I've never had the courage to wake them up, but I think you're going to need to. The spaceman has a suit, and we need him to use it. What do we need the spaceman to help? Uh, where are the, where are these things? I've seen these all over. They put people in them, and the people go to sleep. They stay asleep for a really long time too. Be careful if you touch them, though. They're really cold. Uh, who are these people? I don't know. I've never talked to them. Sometimes I'd come and look at them and wonder why they're dressed like that. You see that one guy? He has this really neat suit on, like armor or something. And that other guy? He looks just like a cowboy. I saw pictures of cowboys in books. I never saw a real one, though. All right, why do we need a spaceman to help us? Well, because he's got a spacesuit. Can't go out in space without one. And if we're going to escape, we need to go outside. If they turn out the elevator things, that's the only other way to go. So we need a suit. See? Simple. All right, let's wake these people up. This is going to be so neat. Let's see what we're working with here, though. All right, let's see who we have. A samurai. A soldier, by the looks of it. Hey, Selma, you're finally here. Just do what the girl says. Get him out of those things. Uh, here's the cowboy. And here's the spaceman. Alright, time to wake these people up. Trigger on that gun? You know, ever kill someone? Huh, <laughs> there's your answer. So, Sally, what happened? Oh no! That poor astronaut. Those freezers are so dangerous. Sometimes people don't wake up. I guess you better take his suit. You're going to have to go if he can't. But first, you have to get to the door to the outside. They'll be waiting for you. But you can suck out all the air and part of the ship, so they won't get in your way. They have these generator things that power parts of the ship and make sure it has air. You'll have to turn some of them off. There's one in the cryo lab, one in the hangar bay, and one where they make the robots, the robot assembly area. Once they're all broken, you can get through that door to the outside. And then, once you get to the top of the ship, you can <coughs> turn the teleporter thing back on, and I can catch up to you. 
I guess it's time for me to get those doors unlocked for you now. This is fun. So, what are these generators? How do they work? Oh, you'll know them when you see them. You push this button, and then this big thing is like, whoosh, and it comes out of the floor. And then, there are these things you press down, and it goes, and then you better get out of the way. You'll see. I have to go. Don't go alone. Those generators are in scary places. Take one of the grown-ups with you. Might as well grab the spacesuit. Spacesuit. Well, fare thee well, Colonel Har Hardingen. You were a noble soul. Never met you. Hi, soldier boy. What's up? What's... what's going on? Who are all these people? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. We're friends. What? I've never seen any of you before in my life. Last people I saw were... Oh my god! Aliens! I was taken by aliens! You! You must be the aliens trying to get into my mind. Well, that's not gonna work! Private Elliot Tekorian, U.S. Army Medic, serial number 3477809. That's all I'm telling you. I'm surprised you can, t you can remember all that. You're a doctor, I can't, and you can't tell from looking at me that I'm no alien. Do I look like an alien? I can promise you I'm not an alien. In fact, I was abducted like you. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you assumed human form. <coughs> I heard they can do that. Or you are human, but they took over your mind. We have no idea how limitless their powers are. If I were with the aliens, the last thing I would have done is released you. I promise you, all I want to do is get all the shit get back home. Fine, I'll just put you back in stasis. Yeah, if I was an alien, I wouldn't have released you. I... I suppose so. Look, all I want to do is get back home and back to the rest of my squad. Wait a minute. My men, my unit. Have you seen them? I'm afraid not. All I found were these people. My guess the aliens had them in a snack of worse. I'm not telling them that. No. I'm afraid all I found are these people. Oh my god. I'm responsible for them. And now they're lost. Or dead. Please, if you mean what you say, <clears throat> that we're all in this together, then you've got to help me find out what happened to them. Don't worry, we are into this together. I'll help you. I swear, if you don't calm down, I'm stuffing you back in the freezer. <laughs> Just relax. Let me see what I can do. Uh, don't worry, we are in this together. I will help you. Thank you. Thanks so much. Sorry about all this. I just can't believe this is happening. Do you think you'll be able to assist us medically if we need it? I'd really like to, but when I woke up <coughs> on this ship for the first time, all of my medical gear was gone. I saw that the aliens on this ship have some sort of viscous stuff they slather onto wounds. Some kind of biological gel. Get me some of that, and I might be able to mess around with it, make some sort of adapted biogel we can use on ourselves. Could you make me some biogel? Sure, here you go. They should work pretty well, but watch out for side effects. Seven adapted biogel. Hey there, what'd you need? Uh, uh, tell me how you were captured by the aliens. Well, it was getting dark. We'd spent the day out in the trenches, keeping as many of the guys alive as we could. Chinese had been pounding on us all day with artillery from these huge guns they had up on the mountains. It was really a mess. Anyway, we pitched our tents and stowed our gear to try and catch some shut-eye. I woke up suddenly, Private Dawkins screaming. He was bathed in some kind of blue light coming from the sky. All of us just froze as he just... Well, vanished. We didn't know what happened. Did the Chinese come up with some new weapon? Moments later, all of us were in the blue light too. The rest, you know. Uh, what do you think the aliens want with us? Or maybe, just maybe, they're responsible for life on Earth. Like, they seeded the planet a really long time ago. And they've been coming back every once in a while to check on the progress. And now they've decided they don't like how it turned out. Can you imagine? They made us, and now they're pissed at us! <laughs> I can imagine. Uh, can you tell me more about where you're from? Me? Well, I was a medic with the 108th Infantry Battalion stationed at Anchorage, Alaska. 
I was with a squad of five other medics. Our job was to patch everyone up after the commies gunned them down. It was pretty bloody. Nothing at all like I expected when I gave up my hospital job to enlist in the army. I have to go. Okay, tell me if you need medical assistance. Let's talk to the cowboy. Where are they? Where are the little buggers? The aliens? They're all over the place. That's why I woke you up. If you talk about aliens, you'll see them soon enough. They're called aliens, Hayseed. Yeah, they're all over the place. Aliens? That what you call them? So you woke me, huh? Who the hell are you? I'm trapped on the ship, just like you. I'm human like you. I'm not a shit-kicking cowboy, that's for sure. I'm trapped on this ship, like you. Do I really look that stupid, kid? <clears throat> this ain't a ship. I don't hear water, and I sure as hell don't feel us rocking. So tell me another one. Besides, you don't look trapped to me. How do I know you ain't working with those little green bastards? Look, all I want to do is work together as a team so we can get home. If I were working with them, why would I set you free? I don't give guarantees. You want out here, you stick with me, period. Okay, look, all I want to do is work as a team so we can get home. The only teams I know are cattle, and they get led to the slaughter. That's why I work alone, kid. Now, you did let me out of that thing, so it counts for something. Tell you what, I usually ride solo, but I'll stick with you for now. You try and pull anything stupid, and I'll bury you. Roger, Dodger. Dama. If you got something you want to say, spit it out. Uh, is it, uh, do you know how to repair it? Actually, <clears throat> I do. I used to tinker with all <clears throat> sorts of junk back home. I'd be glad to take a look at what you need fixed, but it's gonna cost you some caps. Well, given the circumstances, that's, doesn't that seem kind of pointless? Maybe to you, it does. But hey, I gotta think about the future. If we get back down there and I'm broke, how am I going to survive? You know as well as I do that there are no handouts in the wasteland. Yeah, I guess you're right. Good. I'm glad we see eye to eye. Now, let me see what you need fixed. Nothing. Actually, my Valtu could see better days. Yeah? Something bugging you? Go, uh, tell me how you were captured by the aliens. Not much to tell. I heard that radio signal. Thought I'd check it out. Thought maybe I could pull some scrap from whatever was sending the signal. Got a little more than I bargained for. Uh, what do you think the aliens want with us? Hell if I know. I don't plan on starting a conversation to ask, you know? Uh, can you tell me more about where you're from? Does it really matter? I mean, we're fighting to stay alive here. Whatever I did before we got to this point doesn't mean a whole lot right now. Fair enough. Yeah, yeah. Just don't think about ditching me. We're in this together. Where's the samurai? It's the samurai. A boss is up. There he is. Hey, are you okay? Calm, what are you saying? Calm down, trying, oh great, you don't speak English, this is going to be a waste of time. Hey, you okay? I'm sorry, but I can't understand you. Oh great, <laughs> we got a person who does speak, okay, that's fine. Where am I? What you want? Uh, Chad, hey, you've been off. Do you have any stuff in here? You know, I think I have other hints. Yeah, what do you know about this Toshi Oshigago guy? I, I'm permanent to that horribly, but uh, I don't know. What do you know about him? Um, I think he's from the Earth's past. There are people frozen all over the ship that the aliens grabbed wearing funny old time clothes and stuff. Do you know any parts of the ship? Do you know anything helpful about the other section of the ship? It's a pretty big place, and I've <coughs> only seen some of it. They always catch me before I see the whole thing. I've seen the cryo lab. That's where they freeze people and cut them up and stuff. And the hangar. That has the aliens' flying ships and all the stuff they need to fly them. 
And the robot assembly is where they build the big metal robots they use. But the real important stuff is on the top of the ship. I've never been there. I try that hard. Hey, have you been all... Hey, you've been all over. Do you have any hidden stuff around here? Sure I do. I found a secret place they've never noticed. You want some of the stuff I have? Come on, I'll show you. All right, lead me the, lead the way. <clears throat> this place looks so awesome. Can't wait for it to all be destroyed in the end. So where you head, Amy? Is it through here? <clears throat> Ooh. Fourth field. What you want? Uh, I'm good. Be careful, mister. Not bad. Ooh. This is one hell of a DLC, let me tell you that. What the heck is this? Is this a light or something? This is the central all area. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that does it for this episode. I'd like to thank you for tuning in. Do leave a like, subscribe, comment, share the video. And I shall see you in the next episode. Till next time, bye-bye.